What's up students at Park Families? This is David with February's Parent Tip of the Month. Check it out. Hey, before we jump into this month's parent tip, I do wanna remind you guys that we have some really cool things slotted for this summer and registration are already up for two of those, one for junior high and one for senior high. Hey, if you register now, you solidify your uh, you solidify your spot and you make sure that you get the cheapest price possible. So make sure you register soon. We wanna make sure that you take advantage of that um, so that you have an awesome opportunity for your students to experience community and grow in God's word. So it's probably not surprising to you that while there's so much about the world that's good and just and headed in the right direction, there's still so much that's wrong. Whether it's human trafficking, poverty, inequality, racism, human rights abuse, violence, or kids dying from preventable diseases around the world, there's a lot wrong in the world. Not to mention the injustices, inequalities, and wrongs in our own communities. We can't shield our teenagers from these realities forever, and we shouldn't. Instead, we should be considering how we can raise kids to be brave enough to see and do something about the wrongs they see around them. Throughout scripture, the word justice is used a lot. When the Bible uses that word, it means to make wrong things right. So how can we raise justice-minded teenagers? So here's just a few ideas. First of all, point out injustices. You see them in our news or in our community. Secondly, ask for their perspective. What do they think about the injustices that you pointed out? What do they notice? What do they care about? Thirdly, point out wrongs that are being made right, both around the world and in your community. And lastly, encourage them to do something or do something together to help make one of those wrongs just a little bit more right. Even if you don't always love your teenager's perspective or approach, keep encouraging them, keep talking about it because justice matters. Hey, this has been David and this is February's Parent Tip of the Month. Peace.